It has been quite some time, my friends. What's going on? Of course, I am Quita, aka Belasian Quita. And guys, wow, I am so sorry. I have been gone like what it seems forever. And I have a story to tell you today in Riot Talk, but let's get to the intro here. Welcome back to the stream. Welcome to Sin TV, of course, standing for smart, intelligent news. And I am your lovely hostess of the mostest with the curves and galore, Quita, aka Belasian Quita. There we go. <laughs> it had I, I like I can't even believe how like how long I have been gone. It seems like what five or six days, almost like a whole week. Okay, and today's featured game we're gonna be playing, of course, Davillion. And I cannot wait for the actual opening of the game, like the debut when it's finally like release, release. Uh, so it's still in beta right now um, from the last time I checked here. And it's just great. But if you have a Founders Pack, you'll be able to play a little bit earlier. So I still recommend you guys go out, get that Founders Pack. But today's juicy topic of the day, I have two of them actually. First one I have is in regards to and this is a game that i really wanted to have a chance to play when it was actually in the mm the mmo rpg format rusty hearts is back but the interesting thing though interesting thing is it's on a platform that i would not expect the game to be on and also find out later because this kind of ties in uh, shout outs to all the college students out here grinding and hustling to make something out of themselves It is really hard. The economy is still struggling. So I also wanted to talk about that. And I found this very interesting article that was done by the simple dollar.com in regards to the 10 worst college degrees to earn in 2015. So I'm going to give my two cents on it, but let's get into some riot talk here, shall we, as I'm playing Davillion. So, <laughs> all right, guys. So this is pretty much what went down, D -d -d down, down, down. So <laughs> that's the remix, right? So what happened is that not one, but both of my computers that I use for my stream ended up getting the nastiest Trojan virus ever. And I had to not once, but four times reset my stupid computers twice, like each time. And let me tell you, my friends, to reinstall Windows 8.1 is not easy. I'm gonna wait to convert to Windows 10 because, like, for example, some some users have had, or gamers in general, even streamers, period, um, have had problems using OBS in Windows 10. I know some of you, it may have worked. But overall, my friends, let me tell you, it has been quite a journey to get back to where we're at right now. Um, I want to thank each and every one of you as my followers. I have hit a new milestone. 50! followers guys thank you over 50 i am really grateful i had an interesting Wait. thing happen too Ooh, that move is slick okay let's try this out ho, 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 ho. enough said that was slick let's try that again man lick slick moves here i'm just gonna use that for half of the time and be super annoying no kidding JK and see I'm not getting as much of experience as I'm thinking in this game that's the only thing I don't like about Davillion is I mean at least it is regenerated you know faster than how it is in Tree of Savior per se but then it also depends on your actual like attributes here so no lie but no it was crazy guys i had to reinstall everything it took energy. like four hours just to reinstall to reinstall windows 8.1 and here's a funny thing and i know people are gonna be like what's wrong with you in regards to this but not gonna lie oh that's pretty slick that is really slick i really like this move 
Whoa, there are like tons of vultures here. I am gaining like... I have to gain some levels, my friends. Not gonna lie to you. Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. Okay, let's get that health potion. Oh, my inventory is full. Not a good time here. Alright, I'm probably gonna die. Okay, there we go. See, I hate this. Like, you have to... It's like you have to constantly regenerate. Watch, I'm gonna die up in here. Let's see here. And my inventory is full. See, there we go. And I died. Like a real punk, okay? Alright, so let's revive here. And I am gonna go... Let's see. Let me check my inventory here. I have... My inventory is completely full. Where is my... The dog that's supposed to, like... Well, I don't. Maybe Nothing that'll be yet. later on. Maybe no. I think that's when the game is open, perhaps. Can't use this. Because then people who have a founder's Wait. pack, um, you get a, a corgi, which is cool. And I forgot the other one when you get to the higher levels. But yeah, it was just a pain in the butt to reinstall everything. Okay, four hours. But here's the thing, Mac OS, right? That only took an hour. So I don't know when Windows is gonna speed up on their installate on their installation process. Okay, well the corpse is covered in bite marks. That really sucks. Okay, now let me look at why my inventory is super full, because I don't understand why my inventory would be full. That's crazy. Alright, let's see here. See, and I don't like that every move that you use is pretty much not like cool. there we go we're just cleaning house and taking names all right so let's go over here because it's telling me to go over here for some reason it's really strange well yeah so i had to do that because my other computer got a like pretty much same similar trojan so the os took an hour my other computer took four hours but now i even tell you i had to write a list of all of the games that I have and I have quite a list I have some new purchases that I will be making in the next couple of weeks um, a lot of my friends want me to play Fallout 4 they're like yeah it's awesome you should play and I was like okay I will I will try and then play it but yeah it's just been absolutely insane guys like I have really been like busting my butt well, no duh, ma'am. Okay, let's even see here. I don't even I don't even know if I even have quests. I think right now it's just me leveling up. I think that's really what it boils down to. I want to find another place that's a little bit higher level to level up. Quickie? Quickie. Quickly? <laughs> Who wants a quickie, right? No, I'm kidding, JK. Um, so, yeah, guys. It's just been crazy. And then on top of that, not even, you know, that tomfoolery I had to deal with. I also had to deal with installing this yet. all of the games. You know what? I'm going to sell some swag. That's what I need to do. Because I have all this stuff in my inventory that's not even necessary at all. It's just been insane. Like, it's been crazy. You know, I had all these, like, games to reinstall. So this is a list, my friends, of the games that I had to reinstall. First off, I had to reinstall Davillion. Then, I had to reinstall Blade and Soul, Tree of Savior. Oh, I have a friend's request. Interesting. Sweet! I have people that like me! Because people have been hating on me so bad. But one thing I've kind of been learning, especially being on YouTube too... Is you gotta kill them with kindness. Always keep your belongings safe and oh, secure. sweet. Okay, I'm gonna put that health potion here. And let's see. Ooh, additional character slot. Okay, that's sweet. Okay, I got that ban. Okay, I got that magic dust. Okay, I'll put the magic dust away. Okay, I have Nimpa's blessing. Got that megaphone. Okay, I got. That other blessing. Oh no, I don't want that in the warehouse. I'm gonna keep that. Okay. So these are super weak. So let me just put those away. 
Alright, put these simple shoes away. And then put these away. Oh, okay. So I'll have to keep this once I get to level 17. Let me put the whip away. Let's see here. I don't even know where to put all this crap. Okay, so... I'm just trying to open up some space here because I really do need to open up some space. But yeah, it just sucked. Blade and Soul, all this. Like, it was insane, guys, how much reinstalling that I had to do. And it was all because of a stupid, stupid, stupid Trojan. So I'm going to tell you guys right now, make sure that you always have a a backup computer and that's what I'm gonna be doing in the future is I am going to purchase a a backup computer like I need to do that so nope I'm gonna keep that here okay and then I have okay so I'm just gonna put that Halloween candy away I don't need that crap let me put this away okay I am gonna use this health potion so I will make sure I do that too. That additional character ticket I will put away. Uh, okay, let me put that suit away. Uh, let's put that shirt away. Okay, I think I'm good. If you need to store something, let me just put that me. ring on. Let me get that blessing up in here. Let me get Nimpa for a minute. Oh, I can give my pet a name. How sweet is that, guys? How sweet is that? So, what are we going to name the pet? I'm thinking... Hmm, that's, that is a conundrum, right? Let's see, what are we going to name the pet? What are we going to name the pet? I would say... What are we going to name the pet? Hmm... I'm thinking we should name the pet Zora. Or Zor Zori. Yeah, I like Zori. Let's check that. Oh, name is available. Alright, pet has a name. Straight up Zori. Okay, so... Alright, so I am using that suit. This is the plain suit. So, I am going to... Always keep your belongings put that plain suit secure. away. Okay, so I'm going to put these away too. All right, I think I'm good. Yeah, I think I'm good. I think we should be good, guys. All right, so let's rock and roll. I noticed that my frame rate is absolutely atrocious. I have to kind of play around with OBS settings, not going to lie to you. It's the, OB, the OBS settings are atrocious. They are really, really, really bad. Uh, so I'm going to be playing around... Like once my first hour of gaming is done, because what I what I pretty much have to do is I have to kind of split up my gaming periods into like an hour and fifty minutes. Because what I like to do is I like to up like to upload my gaming sessions to um, to YouTube. Oh, mighty strike! Not ready yet. That was epic. Can't use this yet. Yeah, see, and this is the other annoying thing, too. It's like, you can't use, like, anything yet. And it's like, really? Here. Yeah, we go. Yet. I love the fact that you can only use this in, like, one... Insufficient energy. Yeah, why am I not surprised? And I love people like this that are complete dicks, and they just, like... You know, they just don't want you to get a kill. Like, you Wait. know, you're trying to gain experience just like that. It's like, what the heck? Ooh, I like that move. Yeah, I like that. Can't use this yet. This is so stupid. It's annoying. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, I think nope, there's some boars. See, the only thing I like about the villain though, is that your enemies do respawn rather quickly it's not just uh you know bloop and you're done it's more of you know you're ready to rock and roll here okay so there we go yeah i'm gonna have to play around with obs settings because i'm not even getting decent frame rate 
So I like to um, record my videos like I mentioned earlier and then upload them to YouTube. So that's the reason why I've been kind of playing at a... Well, that's the reason why I kind of play like an hour 50. Because I found out from the wonderful community of the Twitch community on Reddit. Um, I will have the link below this stream so you can check them out. I mean, like, what's even the point of me even doing this? When this, like, a-hole is just, like, ridiculous. Like, let other people Wait. play, too. Like, what the fuck? Not ready yet. You mean I'm not ready yet? Like, come on. Alright, there we go. I think this is the area I'm probably gonna hang out for a while. Just because, uh... It's a little more higher-end area. I mean, it's still, like, level... Level like Can't 12 or whatnot. Thing. I am so sick of spiders, guys. Let me tell you. There we go. Can't use this yet. All right. Really? Come yet. on. Ugh. So frustrating, guys. Let me tell you. Wait. I have to wait for what? Like, wait for you? Seriously? No, I'm kidding. But no, that's all that's been going on. You know, I've been working, but oh, guys, great news. Super blessing for me. Ended up getting a, uh, a job interview, and I am really, really looking forward to that. Um, just because I'm like, I seriously need more consistent work. It's like I'm off four days in a row, you know, and I work very hard. I mean, it's just been really rough, Wait. you know, and I've kind of had to slow down, of course, on my spending and stuff. Because like originally, th like this is what happened. The money I was supposed to, to use, right? So I like to buy games for the stream to review and play. Um, but And I notice I've been playing the same kind of games, you know, and this is more of a, vari a variety stream. But one thing I want you guys to know is that I will play a game that I really like, you know, that you guys enjoy too. Um, I won't play, the only thing is I won't play first person shooters. It's not my cup of tea personally. Um, but... You know, any other suggestions for games, I don't mind, you know. My, my friends do want me to play Fallout 4. They keep telling me that, you know. They're like, you gotta play Fallout 4, you know. And I want to do some retro gaming too, like play games, you know, on like NES and Super NES as well. That would be super sweet. Like, I would be super pumped for that. Okay, come on. Wait. Oh, this is ridiculous. Like, hate this. Not ready yet. There we go. Running out of energy. Wait. I'm like trying to get to like the billion level. It's crazy. Not ready yet. Wait. Come on. This is really annoying, you know. And it's not working right for you. Like, come on! Like, it's ridiculous. Not like, ready. not in a good place. Okay, let's hit F3 again. Let's see. I want to put my other attack... I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to put my other attack here at number 5. So at least I have that. The, the, I won't lie, though. The controllers are kind of funky. Yeah, you know who I am. Like... I love enemies that have really dumb catch, like catchphrases. It makes me yet. laugh. See, I really wish there was a nice like you know melee attack. Wait. But what's kind of cool is you can do this where you can just like collect a whole bunch of slave kobolds, you know, and then you just kind of they'll chase you around as you build your MP back, which is kind of nice. Oh, there's a cannibal no. one. Okay. I've also been playing two guys, EL, um, ELOA, the Elite Lord of Alliance. And that's okay. It's pretty it's pretty challenging, though, I won't lie. For a beginner game, I was quite impressed. I was very, very impressed indeed. Indeed! As I play Devillian. No, I'm kidding. No, it's horrible. It's terrible. But no, that's all I've been doing, guys. It's been kind of boring for me this week. You know, I'm... I'm applying for, you know, a different job. But the thing that sucks, though, is the job is not paying as much as this job. Mighty Strike! But it's just like, you're. I, I sometimes I feel like I'm kind of stuck, you know? And it's like, I really want to improve and move on. But let me tell you guys, 
it's Wait. it's it's an interesting yet. equation it's like they tell you hey you need to go to college in order to get a good job that's Can't what they say way. but then Wait. at the same time you know you gotta make sure when you go to college here's my advice please take the time to really learn what you, you know to learn you know and that doesn't mean that be in school for three years and take random classes that's not what i meant um it is important to make sure that you are taking classes for purpose you know so the first two years even before you get into school i'm not even kidding you please make sure that you do go to career counseling or take career assessment because that's gonna help you to figure out what profession you want to be in like some people are blessed and they just know like they know what they're doing they know you know what they're getting into let me like regenerate here it's ridiculous okay here we go yeah like some people they know what they're doing they know you know what field they're getting into you know they they just know which is smart but on the flip side, though, let me check uh, what this is about. Oh, cool. See, these are all my friends here. These are all the recommended players. And um, that's my my friend list here, which is cool. And they're a level 19, which is pretty sweet. So let me see here. Can you? Oh, no. These are recommended players. Oh, I didn't even know I was being attacked. Classy. All right, let's see. I want to go into a strong, even stronger area. I love riding that little llama thing. It's quite hilarious. It is a good time. Wait. Riding the llamas. No, I'm kidding. It's just, that's my epic. See, this game is okay, but I really, 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 really like Diablo 3. I am hot. Let's get into the villain mode. I am sick and tired. Can't use this. Civilian mode is awesome. Cause I'm sick and tired. Not ready yet. There we go. Devastating smash. It's about dang time. It's about time for me to have a devastating smash. There we go. Wait. That'll be the name of my reality show someday. Like devastating smash. All right, let's take a look, see what the heck's over here. All right, let's see. And we have the Skeletal Knight. All right, there we go. Yeah, see, this is the area I need to be, because... All right, let's get my MP back up here. We're just going to gather just a whole crap ton of enemies, because they straight up hate me. Okay, there we go. There we go. We got a mighty strike, which is always fun. And this is the type of game, guys, Devillion, where the more combos you have, that's the better off you're gonna be, to be honest. In the, I mean, you really want to get as much, many combos as you possibly can. But the thing that's kind of interesting about this game too is is taking forever. It takes forever, not even kidding you, to gain a level. So we got a deadly blow. That was a first. Alright, there we go. Not ready yet. Yes. Good combo. And I like that the enemies do respawn rather quickly, so we're just gonna just get a crap ton of them here. Man, these spiders are not playing. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Get that coin. Oh, critical. So I see. The more enemies you have, of course, that's the better your combo is going to be. And I'm doing pretty well, too, in Diablo 3. I was like a level, like, 43, I think. So I'm not even near the goal of 70. Um, I am part of a guild called MDK. Shoutouts to them. They're really awesome and super, super nice for taking this noob. <laughs> I am such a noob. Yeah, I mean, PC gaming is something that I, I mean, well, I'll tell you the story too of uh, my PC gaming experience. I've been doing it for maybe I'll say like five years or so. Like, I started probably like when I was in my teens and 
you know, I got into those really cool games like Lighthouse and stuff like that, and Shivers and stuff. But what really, really, really got me, honestly, in the PC gaming too was Tomb Raider. And let me tell you, my friends, I cannot wait until I play that Rise of the Tomb Raider. It is absolutely amazing. Okay, let me even go this way. All right, let me get my uh, MP up here. Okay, I think we're good. There we go, Mighty Strike. Oh, we are so close, guys. I think we may level up, my friends. I think it's about to go down. It is about to go down. But yeah, this game still has a lot of work to do in regards to frame rate. Like, I am really not impressed. Uh, I mean, the clarity, though, has, is great. Like, it's amazing. Like, absolutely amazing. But overall, frame rate for OBS. Like, OBS has been really kind of rough. If I could afford it, I would probably get XSplit and try using XSplit. But overall, it's an okay program for me. Um, now, the other reason why it was taking me so long, too, was that I was... Uh, I was working on ooh clean sweep that is a new status for me <laughs> beyond my sucky love life no i'm kidding no love takes time guys let me no, tell you no. it really does like you know don't don't feel because you see your friends and they all have a partner that you know you, like you Wait. never will because like that's how i used to feel too but one thing that's important is spending that time with yourself the more you spend that time that's the more you understand who you are, you know? Mm. I had to get some juice. You know, keep keep the keep the throat lubricated here. And we have up Lady Lee Ann. How you doing? What is up, darling? As I'm like dying here. I'm completely getting like parted on. <laughs> Level 16. There we go. Be all theatrical. How are you? Like, what's going on? What's going on? No, I'm not this. I actually it was really funny, guys. There is this really cool um, doc. Oh, not documentary. Um, I am a huge fan of Pablo Francisco. He is hilarious. Pablo Francisco. If you have not had the chance to check that guy, to check him out, he is an amazing comedian, and he does this like the stereotypical like Valley Girl voice so perfectly like it's amazing like absolutely amazing like he's just like oh my gosh so let me tell you i was at ember combi and then all of a sudden these other girls like try to t like talk to me and i was like don't even talk to me because i'm hot okay like that's that's like the voice he does it is absolutely smashing and it, you know, it was really funny today too, like some of my um like some of my friends were saying, like they always were like, You sound like a white girl. But then in the back of my mind, I was just like, What does a white girl sound like? Because like I have white friends that sound blacker than me. And it is absolutely like hilarious. Devastating smash. Okay. Spinning them this darling. No, I'm kidding. Just I am just wrong on so many levels. But yeah, so Leanne, what's up with you? Oh, we got Wizard 410 in the building. Yeah, that's as probably as ratchet as I'm going to get today. No, I take it back. I am going to be super ratchet today. I know you guys love it when I am super, like, ratchet. <laughs> like, anytime I'm super ratchet, like, the y'all, oh, man, the chat room just, like, blows up for reals like you guys just get like epic with me and the last couple of sessions i've had has been absolutely in like insane like people were just mad it was like people kept saying the n-word and stuff it was pretty funny not enough energy but i won't lie some of it was getting to me but then i realized that like you got to you got to kill people you know with kindness you know um you don't want people to you, you don't want people to be like they can take advantage of you you know and like i had that like see when you're a critic i'll say this when you are a critic though it it can be a pain like people feel like they can just say whatever they want to say to you right and you have an opinion too you know everyone's entitled to their opinion but like okay so like what i do 
can't. Oh, I know on my other program, uh, Kirby Melhead Show. Yet. You can check it out. YouTube.com slash user slash Belasian Quita is I actually talk about other YouTubers. And let me tell you how inner like people take some of the stuff I say so interpersonally to the point where it's kind of a little bit hilarious. So I had someone comment, right? And it was it was great, okay? So they were comment I, I was, you know, talking about this other YouTuber and how I felt. You know, and she's great. I mean she's a pretty girl, you know, all of that. And I had someone comment and they made a list and stuff and they were like, first off, because that's how I'm picturing them being like they're like, first off, like you you just bitter and blah you know and blah blah blah. I was bitter and you know like I should focus on myself. Uh, like first off, you know, if you don't like what someone if see this is this is the thing that always blows my mind, and it's such a simple concept for people. If you don't like what someone says, don't invest in them. It is simple as that. Like, don't invest in them. If you don't like what someone has to say, if it gets on your nerves, you know, then don't waste your time. Because the more you give value to people who you feel are valueless, that's the more popular they're going to get. That's just the bottom line. And it blows my mind. Okay, this is going to be a good one. Woohoo! We're cooking today, babies. Let me tell you. No, I'm kidding. So we got Uplay, Lee, Ann, and the Wizard 410. So guys, let me know, like, what's up with you? What's been going on with you? Your homegirl's here for you, okay? You know, I'm not gonna be one of these streamers where it's like, yeah, I'm just gonna focus on myself because I'm just self-centered and conceited because people are watching me right now. You know, I'm not gonna be like that, so... Yeah, chat room's open, my friends. Let me know what you know, what's on your mind, what you think, and also what do you think about the juicy topic of the day? I'm gonna get to that. I am gonna get to that. Let me just clear this Not devastating yet. smash. I can't use this yet. I know I can't use this yet. Oh, good, Savasa. And you know the thing that sucks is I'm doing all of this, and then they're gonna clean out the servers before the debut. And then it's like, I'm starting all over again. But that is okay. That's okay. I'm, I will survive. It's it's not a problem. You know, it's pretty crazy. All right. So, featured YouTuber of the day, my friends, is Lazy Game Reviews. If you have not checked out this YouTube channel yet, you have to. He does the best reviews that I have seen on, on YouTube. Actually, I like him better than Angry Joe Show. Just saying. So, youtube.com slash user slash ph. It's like, it's like pre freak. It's like pre. It's like free kindy or something like that. And I will have the link below. He does these amazing game reviews. He does old school. He does new school. He actually did probably one of the better reviews on Fallout 4. Because it seems to me the whole premise that everyone's doing with Fallout 4 is they're just like, Yeah, Fallout 4 sucks. And like for me, the thing was, I just wanted to know like what was the big deal about the game. But like what I understand now is that Fallout 4 is all about customization. And it's an open world concept, which is interesting. And the only thing that's kind of stopping me, and I know it's horrendous, is the price tag. I think 50, like $60 is kind of ridiculous for a game. Just That's just me personally. I, just, I don't think that's worth it. I really, I, I mean, in regards to like the price, I think they should have kept it around maybe 50 or so. But 60 I was like, man, like I want to try it, but... I think what's kind of, I think what's kind of stopping me, which is kind of sad, is the fact that um, it's kind of expensive for me. You know, Bethesda has always done a good job with their games, not going to lie. Um, but I just don't like a lot of the reviews that were done about it. Like, they didn't really explain why it sucked. They just said it sucked. Like, there was no plausible reason it wasn't like okay maybe it was due to like i remember the review that lazy gamers did which i thought was pretty good oh yes this is a dungeon i think we should do this my friends okay so let's find a group i want to find a group i want to see if anybody's gonna do this with me 
And also, too, guys, if you play these games, let me know. Oh, I think we found some people, guys. We're going to find some people. Yes, wizard. Games are too expensive. I'm breaking my bra trying to buy this stuff. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, my gosh. No, it's ridiculous. I was like, $60 for Fallout 4. You know? But here's the thing, though. I will give Bethesda credit for this, though. Let's find a group. Okay, so... I'm going to try this, like, one more time and see. But... Bethesda made the Fallout Anthology, which is that it's like a little like thing like this, which is really, really cool. Um, and then it like makes the cha-ching sound at the end. Um, and it comes with all of the games for the exception of Fallout 4. And it actually gives you a slot to put Fallout 4. So you get, of course, the Fallout, you know, the first one. You get like an ultimate edition of Las Vegas. I don't know what's going on with peeps here. I'm kind of heartbroken. Okay, we'll do it on our own. Screw people. We're gonna, we're gonna do it on our own because people want to be dicks. So let's do it on our own. I know you guys are cheering me on. Yeah, it's like yeah, exactly. It's like two hundred and forty dollars. That's the same thing you can apply uh, to anime as well. You know, as much as I would love to get a box set of some of my favorite shows. It is just absolute, like, oh, okay, whoa, they're coming out of nowhere. Okay, there we go. We got Devastating Smash. I am getting my butt smashed right now. In game, in game. <laughs> oh, classy, right? All right, there we go. So getting my butt whooped here because, you know, I couldn't find people stupid annoying right but yeah it's the same thing i mean these box sets are atrocious excuse me and as much wow they just totally like straight up like ransack you man i am dying at an alarming rate okay there we go yeah but it's just really annoying to me that that sometimes gaming companies they expect us to pay all this money oh thank you fairy for helping me um but yeah oh ho oh, oh, oh. that is not classy that fire would like ruin my perm okay so let's go let's get this done all right let's keep running let's keep a running all right there we go oh shoot i totally clicked out of my window i always do that it's hilarious Oh my gosh, not cool. Okay, yep, gonna die. All right, come on, fairy, help me out here. I need your help, bro. Come on. No, I'm kidding. I always hear bra and like everything. Oh, well, could have done that. Real classy. Okay, totally biffed that. Sorry, guys. But yeah, it's re it's ridiculous. So laid up lean too. Like, what do you think about the price of gaming? It's like, you know, and then people complain. And all right, let's check that daily checklist. Okay. Oh, so let's see what I got here. So, ooh, uh, ooh, I could pick one or the other. Let's see. You know, I think I'm gonna take that. Sweet. Okay, so we got that done. And oh well, okay. Thank you. Just to receive this. Let's see what the heck's in here. Oh, okay. We got a talisman box. Ooh. We got a health potion. I'm gonna be using that jazz. Yes. Okay. And then what the else? Heck. I I got like a whole bunch of crap. Okay, so receive that let's see what this is about just get a whole bunch of items that i don't need isn't that always annoying in um in mmos where you just receive crap that you don't need it's like what <laughs> it's like i just i don't need all this i don't need it no i'm kidding it's horrible okay so all right so we got all this new swag here okay 
So I think what I'm gonna do is just go ape, like just go completely ape crap. And in the next room, it's time to go. It's civilian mode. Okay. Whoa! -ho! And it's civilian time. Hello. Man, I am just not ready. Jeez. Woo! Wait. Let's see. Okay, I'm getting that four combo. Okay, there we go. Honestly, I don't even really care for the civilian mode anymore. I feel like I prefer the non civilian mode because you're able to do more devastation to your enemies than in the civilian mode. You know, to be honest. Come on, don't don't give me that crap, thematic gatekeeper. I don't need that from you. Why are you so thematic? Okay, so we passed level one, guys. Pat on the mofo back. Yeah, uh, next gen game consoles, like, but here's the thing though, it was funny because when it, when it came down to the PS4 versus the Xbox One, right? This is like the most juicy topic that fanboys and fangirls have such a huge issue with. Whew. Oh boy. All right, let's do this. There we go. Not enough energy. Ugh. This is so annoying, guys. I can't even tell you. All right, here we can't go. Use this yet. Yeah, that's what they all say. Like, I can't use, like, anything yet. Okay, there we go. Oh, Royte. Okay, what the heck is that? Okay, so... Can I destroy this? No, I can't. Oh, I see what this is. Okay, so there's the first one. All right. So we beat stage one in the underground path here. Let, let's see how far I get. I think I think I'm gonna pass maybe level two, and then it'll be that would be the end right there. Cause it's so easy to die in this game. Like not even kidding you. Like super easy. And then you see how fast your energy goes too. It's like redog on ridiculous. There we go. No, but. No, all seriousness, yeah, games are getting really expensive. It's getting to the point where I just prefer, like, what the heck is this? Okay, let's get the Daily Patron Award. Okay, so I already got that. Okay, already got my swag. Okay. All right. I think we're good to go here. Okay. So, on top of that, besides the cause... And then here's the thing, like, everyone kept talking about that PS1, you know, not PS1, pardon me, PS4 versus the, um, the Xbox One. And then look how fast the price dropped on it. Because I think what the, you know, the gaming companies are realizing is that, like, people don't have that kind of money right now. <sighs> yeah, I, I don't really like the fanboy thing either, Wizard. It's so annoying. Like, I cannot tell you how many people, ooh, give me crap for this. All right, let's do this. Let's, let's get this guardian done, like once and for all. Ooh, he is whooping me so bad. All right, here we go. All right, there we go. Not ready yet. Are we serious? What? Ugh. All right, let's go over here. Not ready yet. Yeah, these guardians are no joke. Energy. Like, see, I just wish you had a regular melee attack, like how you do in Tree of Savior, where it's okay. There we go. Stage two, we finished that biz naive right there. That was not a good time. Stage three, I have a feeling it's just it's just gonna get worse and worse as we, as we go along here. It's just worse and worse. Yeah, that's kind of true. Yeah, but I just like how fast the price um, ended up reducing. Oh, cutscene. Oh! This is not going to be a good time, my friends. And he has three times the amount of... Uh, he has three three times the amount of killing power or life. <laughs> Alright, so let's just rock and roll here. Ah! Oh! Alright, there we go. 
I think we may have a good shot. I just need that that big attack. See, and my energy is going so fast. He doesn't seem to be that hard of a boss, but I have a feeling like, okay, we're doing good, guys. We just have to make sure we avoid. Ah! We avoid his, like, mega, mega. Oh, I'm out of potions. Yeah. All right, there we go. Oh, I think we got him. Well, no, we don't. We still got two to go here. I am not enjoying myself right now. <laughs> oh, and then look how long it takes for you to regenerate your health. Like, it's embarrassing. Alright. I'm just gonna have to run around like a coward for a little bit here. He's a tough boss, though, not gonna lie. Woo! Alright, here we go. Ah. And see, I can't go to the menu because he would kill me in like a heartbeat, you know? Alright, let's see here. I'm just gonna have to walk around in a circle until I can. Until I get to a point where I'm, I feel like I'm okay. <laughs> So, all right, let's try this here. Okay, so. Oh! I can't. Okay, there we go. See, I'm not to like full Davillion mode yet, which kind of sucks. Okay, so the, at least I have Fairy here helping me a little bit. But, you know. Okay, we're, we're getting there. Okay. Whoa! Come on, fairy. You're supposed to be giving me energy. Alright, there we go. I really wish I could just get into Davillion mode. That would be epic. Because I'm almost done whooping his behind. Like, I'm almost there. It's just like, I gotta be smart here. Alright, let me try this here. Okay, there we go. Ah, shoot. Ah. Alright, there we go. See, I'm being smart about it, guys. Hey, ZRTV, how you doing? Dang it! Ah! Okay. I wasn't paying attention there. That's okay, though. Oh, man. I am in critical... Critical, critical, critical. And I have no more health potions. Let's see here. Oh, shoot. Yep, and I died. <laughs> but that's what happens. Oh, I can revive myself. But let me guess. Oh, yeah, he goes right back to full doggone health. Okay, let's try this here. I just want to get him, like, good. Okay, so there we go. So that's round one. And I should be able to defeat him because he's a he's just a level 13. Like, I should be able to look his behind. Okay, there we go. But he is very powerful, not gonna lie. Varvis or whatever his name is. Like, yeah. He is very, very pop, very, very popular. Yeah, he was very popular in school. You know, he used to like burn people alive. You know, just a real cool kid. No I'm kidding. Uh, but hey, guys, welcome. We are pretty much at the first wave point here of Sin TV. As you can see, I am an absolute coward because I am running out of health here, trying to whoop this demon's butt, and uh, it is not a good time. So what I will do is just kind of run around and uh, do it like this. All right, we are almost to the nitty gritty here. Wow, he totally whooped me. Like, let's see. I have to get a better mouse because this one I've been using it for so long that honestly is just not helping me. And I need to get more potions too. Because this is ridiculous that I can't even beat this guy as easy as this should be for me. And look how long it's taking for my health to go up. Like, it's ridiculous. So, 
I'm almost there. Like, I can taste the victory, but... Oh, it's frustrating, my friends. Frustrating. Okay, so let's do F2. Oh, I didn't even know I could use that. All right, let's get back in here. Oh. All right, there we go. Well, there goes my potion. I don't think I had any more. Okay. We'll just have to run around and do it, you know? But yeah, Zayar TV, what's up? Like, I know it's been a while, but... Yeah, it... <laughs> oh my gosh, it was so crazy. But no, on top of that, like, we were talking all about, like, games being really expensive. And then, like, with PC gaming, like, everyone's like, yeah, get a computer. Well, not everybody has that kind of budget, you know? And even with the console gaming, the price has gone down tremendously because what they realize now is people necessarily can't afford that five, $600 price range. And then when you got games like $60 a piece, it's like, what do you expect people to do? Like, what do you expect people to do? It is extremely expensive and it is just not a good time. Like for me, the only reason why I was able to get this computer period was due to the fact that like I was able to, um, you know, I had a friend who was pretty much a PC gamer, period, and he was the one that was uh, nice enough to get me this, you know, to get this. Well, he already had it built, and then he gave it to me for a really good price. So that's how I was able to get it. And, you know, custom built is the way to go, you know, because you can always take the parts out later and do it for, you know, what you need. And, yeah, it's just kind of frustrating lately, you know. Just like how this is frustrating. Like, I should not even be doing this. Like, my health should be regenerating so quickly. All right, there we go. All right, there we go. Ooh, I got that critical. And he killed me. Dang it. Hmm. Okay, it's harder combat. Hmm, I don't want to leave the dungeon though. Okay, let me see here. Oh, this is the marketplace. I don't need this crap. Okay, let me see here. Yeah. I just want to whoop him for a little bit. Let's see, I was already out. <laughs> uh, it's annoying, right? Yeah, I think you should do PC Gaming Lizard. Here's a couple tips, though. Um, buy something that works in your price point. Don't listen to what people say about, you know, buy a $1,000 PC. If you can afford that, great. But make sure, and here's the other thing. Just because you buy a $1,000, you know, PC as an example of this does not mean that your peripherals, you know, match it. And if you are going to buy one that's already pre-made, um, make sure you do reviews of the company that you're buying it from because a lot of times they'll you know They'll put a one terabyte hard drive and for people that are not uh, what I like to call computer literate um, They'll be like yeah, that's really cool And they put all this you know spiffy specifications and it doesn't work for them the way that it's supposed to you know And that's what I really recommend for people to make sure that they check you know check multiple reviews before buying a custom built PC or having one made, you know, well, a custom made PC that's already pre built. If you decide to build your own, there are cool websites like PC Part Picker and stuff, but make sure, you know, you know what you're doing. Because there's a lot of times people like buy, you know, they build a computer, but they have no idea what the heck that they are doing. Like, they have no idea. It blows my mind how people do not know what they're doing it's it's ridiculous sometimes like people just you know they just buy a computer because they think it's cool you know it's like no make sure you buy a pc because it works for you and one thing about streaming you will need high speed internet um right now i'm rocking a 30 by 3 and most people i see them with like a 50 or 60 or whatever a by 5 or whatnot but if you know as you know you don't like you gotta get what you can afford like if you can only play mmos just do that for a while and then as you build your audience you know and if you are blessed people will um 
you know, give you donations, that type of stuff. Um, then you can build it, you know, build a PC the way that, you know, you want and and you're able to kind of return that kindness to your audience. Because one thing I tell people is people do not have to donate to your channel, but people do it because they love you and they care about you and they enjoy it, you know. And I mean, yeah, you know, there are people who troll by giving donations too, which is always kind of funny. Uh, but yeah, that's just some advice, Wizard. I would say... You know, when it comes to that, you want to make sure, you know, you, there we go. Woo! That was not a good time there. But at least I'm knocking them down, so I'm okay. I'm on, like, stage three. Stage two and all that was okay. It was kind of not as rough as I thought, but this right here, this the business right here. Uh, but no, that's just some a couple tips, you know. Get what you can afford, you know, make sure you, if you're going to get it pre-built, check the company that you're getting it from, look at the pros and cons, and if you can't build it yourself, you can always go to websites like PC Part Picker, Newegg, stuff like that, Then they'll be able to help you. I am super gassy, sorry guys. My friend made some really awesome chili with like, she mixed it with like, I forgot what she put in it, but it was amazing. I, I like a thicker chili. I hate chili that's so wet though, but then, you know, it's it's cultural too, you know, I'm not even gonna lie to you. Super cultural. We are almost done beating this guy. I just wanna get this stupid energy up. This is the only thing I don't like about this game, is it takes forever for you to, like, get where you need to be. Let me tell you, it's a pain in the butt. But we're doing good though. I should've just done this a long time ago. Would have beat this guy's behind already. But, uh, yeah, it just, you know, it, it takes a while to build, you know, your gaming collection, too. Unless you're a spoiled brat and you have tons of money. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> JK. No, seriously. No, I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. Um, no, not all rich people are spoiled brats. I think that's just, the. it's amazing how people just make assumptions and, you know, people stereotype, you know, each other but sometimes stereotypes can be funny like for example for me you know when my friends first met me too some, some of them automatically assume that you know I just ate chicken all the time and it's like no <laughs> you know I eat a little bit of everything and if I eat chicken it's baked or boiled now you know I don't eat fried chicken that like I used to maybe once a year you know when you just want to treat yourself to something nice but I, I've really been taking the time to care about my health and, you know, being the best that that I can be, which is super important to me, quite frankly. You know, oh, that move, that move was devastating there. He whooped my butt. Shoot. And I'm almost done whooping his. You know. Yeah, I mean, one thing I will tell you, though, those upgrades, you know, take your time with it. Like, this computer, the graphics card in it is a GX280. I mean, that's a couple years old. Um, but it, it works for what I'm using it for. Because the first thing that my friend asked me in the first place was, okay, what is going to be the purpose of you using um, your PC for and that's the first question you have to ask yourself too before you even start that process is are you going to be playing games like Fallout 4, Battlefield, you know, or are you going to be playing Call of Duty and that. So you may need a computer with higher, you know, specs if you want to play it on ultra settings. But most of the time the games that I play are like this, like MMOs. So graphically, some like for the exception like Terra for example, that's ridiculous. And very few computers I see, unless you you know are you have an ultra computer. Even some people who have had an ultra computer have had issues with um, with it. You know, to be honest. Okay, so let's continue here. Ah, shoot! I got caught in his. But that's okay. I'm gaining. You know. Yeah, it really is. I think there are a lot of stereotypes in the PC gaming community, and it's irritating, such as, you know, I sometimes I get people in chat where they're literally like, if you are not, if you don't have like a 
$2,000, $3,000, even a $1,000 PC. You can't do this. And then there are people that are NVIDIA fanboys and fangirls. There are people who are just, you know, straight up AMD. There are people who are very, very, very loyal to the brands that they like. And quite frankly, you can't be like that. I, I just... You know, to me personally, I have to be, you know, with the brand that I can afford. I cannot be the type of person that's going to be like, yeah, I'm just going to get all this expensive stuff because I'm trying to be a fangirl and make everybody else feel butthurt. Like, I'm not going to do that. It's it's kind of stupid. <sighs> it's really ridiculous. Just like how this is ridiculous. I should have saved my potions why did i think of that all right let's try this again all right we are almost oh my gosh we are almost done whooping this guy oh frustrating we are almost done i just want to whoop him but then i will die because he has this one attack that is just so lethal you know like that is very very lethal okay let me try again here Ooh. oh don't you hate that like when you're at the point of victory and uh, I'm sorry guys this took forever I should have been smarter and stocked up on some potions but you know homeboys broke here so he's just like I'm just a wandering adventurer with no money but nice clothes though no it is. Okay. Like, once I get into, like, maybe 400, I'll be okay. But this is the longest battle in Sin TV history. Gary and Dan see it. And I'm almost done with this prick. That's the thing that's so funny. Okay, let's try. Okay, let's try from the distance here. Ooh! No! Oh, my gosh! I just... I can't. I'm out of here. Done with this. <laughs> Oh, oh my gosh. I, I'm done. That was stupid. That was really stupid. I'm going to have to go back in. That was really dumb. I, I, I checked out of that one. That was stupid. I can't believe I died like that. Like, what the heck? Alright, so let me... Let me even see what this is about. Oh! Oh, okay. So I have a new skill here. This is Blazing Blade. And I also have Darkness Blade now. So let's see if this will add to the tomfoolery here. Okay. So I think I'm going to put this here. Put this as my number two. This is Dark Side Whip. Okay. Let's see. Let's try the Darkness Blade. Okay. Is mayhem's revenge okay we're gonna try that dungeon again but this time i'm gonna be i am gonna be smart okay i have 2500 credits let's see <laughs> okay let's let, uh let's see here appearance mount okay let's look at functionality jeez that's expensive And so you can get different mounts too, which are pretty sweet. Okay, let's see here. Oh, that's cool. You have one that just automatically picks up crap. That's kind of funny. And then you have, yeah, let's check out the Corgi. Because I heard the Corgi is super awesome. Like, super sweet. Alright, let's see here. Alright. Alright. And apparently you get wings. Oh, look at those. That's pretty rad. I like those. All right. That's pretty cool, though. Let's zoom in on those. Yeah, that looks pretty rad. Not gonna lie. Uh... Okay, pet's name. Uh, let's see. What should we name the Corgi? And we have Tomas underscore dk what's up my friend how you doing 
I like that. Hello, by the way. I'm just picturing you with like a powdered wig and you you saying hi. Pardon me, guys. It takes a lot to like when I'm projecting, my throat just gets super dry. You know, I think we're gonna name the corgi this your name because that's an interesting name. It's like Toma, Toma, Toma. That's what we'll call. Let's check. Name is available. Corgi's name is Toma. Dang it. So we have this corgi. <laughs> oh my god, that is awesome. Oh my gosh. Corgi. Classy Corgi. Alright, let's let's check out the Corgi. Let's see. Here's Toma. Alright, let's see. Uh Alright, so let's open it up here. Okay, so you can have inventory in here as well as you can sell items, which is super sweet. So let's go into our inventory here just as an example of this. Okay, so. Okay, so we can't move it to the pet inventory. Okay, so let's just close that. Alright, let's see what the heck's in here. Okay, so we got a health potion box. And then, uh. Uh. See, I'm so close to that, that suit. Okay, so I'm gonna get. I forgot I had those potions. Alright, let's go back to that stupid dungeon. Because. And I will have Toma the Corgi follow me around here. Oh, Zen 2K5. Uh, 1 5. You know what game this is, my friend? Oh, we got another friend request. Apparently, people like me today. Because I usually don't get these type of friends requests. I get the complete opposite. Like, people think I'm some kind of, like, a tool a-hole. But I'm a very nice person. I really am. I try. No. <laughs> you stopped wearing powdered wigs. That was a long time ago. Were, were you around when Highlander was around, per perhaps? No. <laughs> Highlander is a great series. I am, I'm, like, obsessed with anything with Christopher Lambert and adrian paul like he did this horrible vampire movie though i won't lie it was called the breed it was bad let me tell you how ratchet that was okay i'm gonna try and see if we like i can't find a stupid party for this game what like it's insane oh you've played this game before okay that's cool man It's just kind of annoying. You can't find anybody to do this crap. All right. Sweet. We got people. All right. We got people. We got people. <sighs> okay. This is going to be good, guys. It's going down. It is going down. It is going down. All right. Let's go. Let's go. You got your corgis. Double corgis. All right, guys, this is multiplayer. So we're going to beat this stupid boss. I am totally done. I am not dying. I am done. I am sick and tired of all this tomfoolery. And I like how they're not doing anything. <laughs> ah, don't you love that in team mode? All right. Yes. Let's go. It's you! Okay, there we go. No, this is a cool game. Alright. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm dying. Do you see how fast I was dying up in this? Alright, there we go. I like how they're not even helping me. Like, true jerk off. There we go. Alright, I'll let them finish them off because they want to be dicks. There we go. See, I'm going to be a dick too from now on. No, I'm kidding. I will, I will try to be nice. Okay, so we got to get away from this thing. Okay, I'm going to work on damaging this right here. This flame machine. <clears throat> Shoot. Oh, there we go. Nope, they can figure that out. Alright, uh, F3 here. Okay, there we go. I, like, I mean, they're just not even helping. Like, this is the worst game I've, I've ever had. 
Okay, there we go. That was horrible. There we go. Don't, I mean, don't you love it when players are like this? Okay, I'm gonna just grab this. I'm just gonna grab all the extra swag. How you? How you not gonna take your money? Like, ratchet? No play. <laughs> yes, the game is free, Zen. It is free. And I'm sorry I'm not seeing follower no, uh, notifications. Let me tell you the tomfoolery critical. Who's the boss now? That would be me. Um, so this is what went down. So OBS has this feat. Well, there's what's called Twitch alerts, okay? And Twitch alerts, you can turn it on. And pretty much what happens is you get to see the notifications of people that are following you. Well, what happened with me for some reason after I did this reinstall with uh, with Windows 8.1, it's not working. I cannot get OBS to work with uh, or by Twitch alerts to work with OBS. And look at these people. They're not even helping me with this. What kind of party is this? This is like the worst party I have ever been in. Like, I might as well have done this by myself. Like, these are some ungrateful peasants right here. All right, let's do that. All right, let's do that three here. Yeah, I'm gonna let, yeah, I'll let you guys fight for a doggone change because you guys just don't wanna hold it down. Like, what the heck? They're a horrible, horrible party. Like, and, and they're, oh, I see why. They're like, not to be elitist like that, level 13. It's ridiculous. Yeah, the game is free. Davillion is free to play. Um, however, if you want that Corgi, you actually have to pay for the found, the Founders Pack. Which, I won't lie, we're a little bit high for a game like this. Alright, so we passed the first stage. Finally. Oh my gosh. I like how the other person left too, like a real dick. What a dick. Whoa, I gotta be careful here. Here we go. Whoa! Shouldn't have done that. But that's okay. They're a real dick to leave me like this. Alright, I'm in civilian mode. Let's go. You wanna play? Let's play. Okay, I'll just keep it like that for now. Yeah, they were such a dick. Like, they didn't even... They left the party. And let them ask me to play Not with them yet. again. I will never. How long am I going to be streaming? Um, I will be streaming for an hour and 50 minutes. And then I'll come back. And then I play a different game. Because, like, what I do is I stream an hour and 50 minutes just because... Um, the requirements for YouTube is you can't have the video, well, for Twitch, pardon me, to upload it to YouTube. It cannot be any longer, it's weird, than, like, under two hours. Like, if it's over that, it's more likely to fail. And that's what I found. Okay, guys, are we ready for this right now? I think it's gonna go down. I think we got this. And if he leaves, I'm just gonna be pissed, period. I'm gonna just be like, you know done all right so we got this guardian but here's a funny thing though like having two people in the party do it doesn't even help it doesn't even help like i was thinking it was gonna help but apparently not there we go he's not as they're not as strong as i am so my, that might be the reason why and see here's the thing it's like work on your stuff people like yeah i took the potion because you were a dick <sighs> but yeah i usually play an hour and 50 minutes and then i come back and play something else all right guys we got this bot it's going down oh that was stupid of me There we go. Yep, real smart. Okay, let me get away from this brick. All right, let's see F four. Come on. F four. Is it not working? What's going on here? I just like how he's letting me do all the fighting. Like, 
That's so stupid. Alright, let's see here. Yeah, it's just not helping. Yep, I'll let you do some of this work. Because you guys were dicks to me. Oh, shoot. Where is this guy? Where is he? Okay, there he is. I'll let him finish the first half because I just can't. I don't know what's happening to my potions here. Whoa, I could have died right there. All right, let's see. There we go. Now we're doing some teamwork. It's, it's starting to happen. I like how my Corky is in the middle of all this stuff. Yeah, it's, it's kind of hard. Yeah, you can download the game. I believe I'm not, I'll do like, I'll do some research and see. I believe, I'm not too sure if it's, no, I no, it's open beta. So you should be able to download it once it's open beta. But every game is different though. Yeah, because it would be fun to play this with people who are like, you know, not a-holes. All right, there we go. Jeez. And I love how I can't, I can't even regrow my my stuff here. Okay, let me come over here. Let's see. All right. Oh, I wasted that turn so bad. But at least, see. That's so funny that in this game, your MP is a lot faster. He's gonna die again this way. Shoot. Alright. But see, he's pretty strong though. This guy. For a level 13, he's doing pretty good. Watch, I'll die like right here. Shoot. I'm trying not to die so we can finish this stupid boss. Because he's really stupid, this boss. Let's see. I think he's doing the same thing as me because he knows he's about to die, too. Alright, let's see. Yeah, we gotta get him from afar. Like, that's the key. Oh, I'm about to die up in this. I am about to die. Yeah, I'm about to die up in here. Yep, about to die. Shoot. Alright, let me revive. Okay, we may have a chance here. Oh, come on! Alright, come on, come on. We got him. We got him. We. I don't even care at this point. Yeah! What? Oh, you can't download it? That sucks. Yeah, give me a one star for that. Yeah, I got a D. That's okay. I don't even care. Alright, let me see what I can get here. Yeah, let's get that chaos fruit. Oh, open. Okay. Oh, you don't even get to pick the item that you need. That's really dumb. Okay. Oh, so we got experience. Well, that's nice. Alright. Oh, now he wants to come back. Oh, and you think you're getting these items? Absolutely not. Because you were a dick. Alright. I don't even know. Okay, let's exit. That was really stupid. Sorry, guys. Oh, it takes five to seven days? Huh. That's really dumb. That was dumb. Okay, so... Well, got to level 17, though. Let's see what items we got here. All right, so we have a Windbrook ring, um, which is not as good as this one. And then I don't even know where my Corgi... Where, where is my Corgi? There we go. Corgi! <laughs> okay. All right, so... <laughs> this is the funniest thing, I swear I do declare. Okay, so... 
All right, where's some stuff? Okay, I want to sell that. Yeah, you can leave. That you're stupid. Even his name is stupid. Oh yeah. Okay, let's. Nope, nope. I don't want that in there. Okay. So he can sell it. Boom! Made that money. Thank you, Toma. Good old Toma. All right, let's see what this is about. Okay, so. Ha Okay, apparently you can't classify items. That's really stupid. Uh. Oh. Inventory. Okay, so how you use it? Oh, shift. Oh. You can share items. To expand. Oh, to split the stack. Add in eight inventory slots. Okay, so I can't use this either. This is, I, I swear, this is a really dumb game. Sometimes. Okay, so, oh, I can equip myself. Oh, look at that hot suit right there. All right, and. All right, let me. Not ready yet. Oh, okay, it has to process. That's really stupid. All right, so let's open up the, uh. The pet inventory for the corgi again, and then I'm going to sell this suit. Get that blessing. I think. Oh no, it's still okay. It's still going there. Oh, that was stupid. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, you can't put that in. The, oh well, I'm not putting that in there. Heck no. I earned that. Okay. Let's see. Ten, oh, okay. What's this? Oh. You have seven days remote house ticket. All right, that's pretty sweet. All right, so we beat that dungeon. That was horrible. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Oh, okay, so open beta ends tomorrow. Okay, but the game will be out soon. I think they said it was something like the... I. Let me actually look up the release date for Devillion because I was just like... I want to make sure I'm giving you guys the... Uh, the right information here because I know people are going to to ask about that okay so the official website for Devillion guys is Devillion www.devilliongame.com so oh they have a co-op game that's pretty sweet oh I could just fight in here for a minute let's do that use this yet what are you talking about my okay so let's do this let's just gang up a whole crap ton of enemies because it's really easy all right let's let's go ham not ready yet what do you mean i'm not ready yet this is so dumb oh you're kind of over it you know it's like what the heck it's ridiculous all right let's gather some more of these slithery friends we got here just keep ranking them up. Those kobolds. There we go. I like that. I like the sound of that. That's okay. So open beta is live. He is correct till tomorrow. So if you want to play, it started December second, which is pretty sweet. Yeah, come here. You want some of this? Let's go. Let's go. No, that's. <sighs> I tire myself sometimes. <laughs> but... By being outrageous, I swear. It's ridiculous. But yeah, this is a good place to to just like putz around and gather gather the strength of your enemies. There we go. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, that was pretty good critical. Oh, oh Nelly. Jeez. And the controls are kinda eh, they're alright. I may play this for a while and then take a break and then call it a day for a little bit. Okay, there we go. Come on. Oh, there we go. Good old mighty strike. All right, let's let's collect some more of these ridiculousness over here. All right, get the kobolds. All right, there we go. Okay, I gotta remember that whip attack. 
There we go. Alright, that's the key to Davillion, guys, is... What happened here? The game just decided to freeze. Well, look at that. <laughs>